What's up everyone? Today I'm going to do another hiking vlog. I'm going up to Boulder, Colorado and I'm going to hike the trail that goes up towards Royal Arch. And the reason why it's called Royal Arch is because it is a rock formation that makes an arch. So I'm going to go do that. Just finished eating some oatmeal. I'm naked, if you're still watching. Naked drinks. So I'm going to go see what Tyler's up to. Maybe he'll change his mind and he wants to come. So, so I'll catch up to you guys up there. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. What up, dude? Nothing. Have to go hiking. Alright, I'm in my car and I just noticed that I need to get gas. I have fuel lights on, so I'm gonna go get some gas before I head up to Boulder and start hiking. Alright, I made it to Boulder and I haven't got to the park yet where I have to hike, but instead I drove up this mountain road real quick because I wanted to get a good view. A boulder I didn't have to hike to, I just wanted to drive real quick. I'm going to fly the drone here for a little bit. But it's pretty cool. All boulders down there. And I'll be hiking somewhere over here. Yeah, over here. Like I said, another great day in Colorado. So I'm out here enjoying it. That was awesome, so I'm getting way better at flying the drone, so I got some pretty awesome shots, I think. Uh, so now I'm gonna head to the trailhead so I can go or hike up to Royal Arch. So I'll catch you guys at Chattaqua. Made it to Chattaqua, I'm at the trailhead. I'm about to go over there to the Royal Arch. Today's a perfect day to hike, so I'm looking forward to it. So I'm hiking this way over here somewhere. You can see the Royal Arch. You're going to see people over here walking. That's what I'm trying to get to. I think I can go this way. And it'll take me to over here. I don't know. All I know is I have to go over here. Don't you sometimes just miss being a kid? Be able to go on field trips like over there? <laughs> Man, I wish I was a kid living in Colorado. It looks like they're uh, doing some work. Last time I was here, it wasn't like this. So like they're doing some restoration, which is good. I love the flat irons. Unexpected point in the trail. Um, last time I was here, there weren't any closures. Well, it looks like there's one now. I didn't check the website or any signs to know if where I can go is even accessible today. But I guess we'll find out. That's part of adventuring, right? Yeah, the whole main trail is cut off. So, I don't know what I'm going to do. I think I can cut through these woods and get to the other side. I think that's where the other trail is to get to Royal Arch, but I'm not entirely sure. I was following these two women, and I think they're just as lost as I am. Great day though. I think it's like in the high 50s, low 60s. It's a little humid today. Whew. But not too bad. Alright, so there was a split in the trail, and I found a map to show me how to get to the Royal Arch. Um, luckily, only the main trail going to the parking lot is under restoration, so now it looks like it's smooth sailing from now on. So yeah, it's been a pretty good, uh, pretty good week. Um, I started my new job with the Green Solution, which is in the cannabis industry. It's one of the reasons why I moved out to Colorado. This being the other to experience all this, so it feels good to be a step in the right direction. Also, I mean, I love being able to wake up at six in the morning, which I'm not a morning person, and actually be happy to go into work. Like, not many people have that pleasure in life, be able to be happy about what they're doing. Up here's a trail map. 
you are here. I have to go here. Yeah, is that the right way? Like I said, I'm super happy about starting my new job. Uh, it just feels great to be in this industry finally. So, I mean, April's just been great. It's been an awesome month. And May's gonna be even better. I have some friends coming. One from Georgia and one from Florida. They've never been out to Colorado, so they better experience all this. They've watched my videos, which is cool. But, <sighs> camera doesn't do it justice, and they'll find out. And look at this. Dope. Only a mile. That's not bad. Yeah, my friend Cody is coming. He's never even flown on a plane before. So that'd be a new experience for him. He's probably nervous and kind of scared, but I'm sure he'll be fine. All right, well, I'm gonna continue my hike to the Royal Arch. A few days ago, I believe it was uh, last Saturday, it snowed the whole day. So some snow on the ground still here. You can see right there, there's still some snow on the ground. A lot of it's melted. Here we go, look at all the runoff coming down. That was awesome. See how cold it is. Woo, bam. Freezing. Oh, it's like so cold, it's refreshing though. Oh, mountain water. I'm like halfway to the arch. Something like that. But not too far. Boulders and boulder. Right here are the first and second flat irons, I believe. And there's a trail that'll take you to all of them. So it's pretty cool. Those are the big rocks jutting out, like a 45, 60 degree angle. The Royal Arch is part of the Flat Irons. Just not as big as those. They're more prominent in the boulder landscape than this one. Always gotta be a little bit of interest. Climb up stuff. It's always cool seeing animals on my hike. Like I said, remember the first and second flat iron? I think this is the second one. You see how big it is? It's massive. Oh yeah, in case you guys didn't know, there's still dinosaurs in Colorado. Don't be fooled by this bird. It's very, very vicious. So I put the camera away and I decided to do a little climbing. I got to the pretty nice part, pretty high up. What do you think? I tried to get up here, but it was just uh, a little risky. See a flat iron in the background. The view from here is pretty cool. Uh, I believe Royal Arch is in this area right there. I gotta go down and then up again. A lot of snow over there. The view over here is fucking awesome. Alright, I'm gonna try to safely make my way back down without any broken equipment or broken James. So. Alright, I'm here at the Royal Arch Summit. Um, it's been a pretty good hike. It's a little chilly up here, not too bad. The view's spectacular. A little overcast, there's all a boulder. Over here. Right there in the center of the frame is Denver. All right, so I'm here at the Royal Arch. I climbed up a little even higher than the arch. It's a little dangerous, but um, I was okay. I got up here just fine. Check this out, pretty high up. But yeah, I'm pretty much in the flat irons. See one here. And the best ones are over here. I've never been this close to the flat irons. It's so dope. 
Yeah. <laughs> Everyone else is down here. So, you know me, it had to be some sort of adventurous on my hikes. A little bit of adrenaline junkie, I guess, becoming a Coloradian. But this is awesome. The view up here is spectacular, guys. I can see so far from everywhere. Nothing's like impeding my view. It's, oh man, it's kind of scary. I'm a little nervous being up here, but worth it, worth it. I got some shots of the arch too. I haven't even thrown that in yet. It's been taken in the view, so I'll spin back down to the bottom and we'll check out the arch. There you guys. And this is Royal Arch. See, it's a pretty sweet, pretty sweet rock formation. I like how it arches over like that. Then you just walk through there and you can see a nice view. That's where I was earlier. That's where I climbed up to. Definitely a really cool natural rock formation. Like, it's cool you can find these abnormalities in, in nature. This is so beautiful. So I'm gonna try to make my way back down to my car. I think it's like maybe an hour hike down. It's not too bad. Like I said, a really cool rock formation here in Boulder, Colorado. Always like doing this hike. It's so fun. I'm glad I got on video this time. Some of my earlier vlogs the one over here. Right there is Mount Sunitas. It's a pretty nice hike. Might do that when uh Raven and Cody are in town. So I made it back down to the trailhead. The car's not too far away. I can see it from here, actually. Uh, I, I just find this like a funny observation. So like when I first moved here, you know, even like Tyler and I, we would go hiking. We would just wear like normal clothes, normal shoes and whatnot. I just passed like a group of people going up there and it looks like it's about to rain. And they're in there with just pants and like short sleeve shirts and like tennis shoes. I'm like, oh, these guys don't know what they're doing. But that's what they have to pick up on living here. It's only been like my fourth one here and I already picked up on it so I feel bad for them. I was going to say that uh, the wind picked up a lot and the storm's definitely coming in but I definitely got up and came back down at the right time. It's not looking good. Shit guys it's starting to rain. Not good. Not good. My car's in sight though I think. Hopefully they get towed. I don't know but oh my god it's starting to rain. I gotta go. Okay, well, it was just a light drizzle. I made it back to my car. I'm not drenched, thankfully. I'm not gonna end the vlog just yet. It's only like 3.30, so it's got plenty of sunlight. I think I'm gonna go down this road over here. Uh, I think it goes through a canyon, and on the other side, I think I can see the Rockies, so I'm gonna try to get some drone footage over there. So I'll catch up to you guys when I go find my drone. Was dope as fuck. Oh man, find the drone, you have a good vantage point. It's awesome. Got some pretty good footage there. All right, let's continue up this mountain, see what else I can find. Maybe get some more shots. Made it to this cool lookout spot. You can see Long's Peak in the background. That's awesome. Cool. This is what I wanted to see the other side of the mountain because you can see the Rockies. It's dope. Definitely gonna find the drone over here. God, Long's Peak looks so awesome.
guys. This guy up here literally has a lake and a castle in the mountains. I'm about to drive up on it right now. So I drove further down this road and I decided to turn back around because it didn't connect to where I thought it would. So I figured I might as well get this house into the vlog because it's it's really nice and it's in the mountains, which is even better. There's this lake right there. This house, I'm not even kidding. It is huge. So dope. It has a gate and everything. I almost want to get drone footage of it. It's so big. Ah, oh, you can't see it. Crap. Well, the guy definitely has his uh, privacy down because I could hardly get any clear shots the whole time I drove by it. So my day is coming to an end. I'm driving back home now. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog there. I think I'm gonna end the vlog there. It's been a really, really good day. And I'm off tomorrow, so I might you know, find something to do tomorrow. Or I might just edit the video, who knows. I hope you enjoyed everything you saw. Just make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and you know, share it with your friends. I'm sure they wanna see what Colorado has to offer. But I'm, all right, so I'm going down a mountain Road and I should not be filming and driving. This is so dangerous. So like I said, I'm gonna end the vlog here for I wreck and you see me on the news later. Peace guys.